And Dennis, you guys have struggled a little bit to, to score the ball um, against the Phoenix defense. I'm curious, kind of with, with AD potentially out, what are the things that you guys are going to have to do? Oh, I mean, we watch film. We got better today. Um, what we need to do, and uh, we're gonna do it tomorrow. I mean, uh, watch a long, you know, film session, talking about a few things, and um, yeah, we try to come out tomorrow and uh, you know, do a better job. Is it more like scheme stuff, or or is it style of play, Dennis? Is 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 it? I, I guess is it next as well, or is it more of a mentality? I mean, it's both. Um, I think everybody got to understand how, you, you know, we've been playing, um, even when, you know, LeBron uh, or AD was out, you know, during the season. Um, I mean, how we just, you know, moving the ball, how we moving without the basketball, um, be in certain spots. Um, like unselfishness without play, uh, without the ball, if that makes sense. So make the cut for somebody else to get open. and. Um, I think that's what we worked on today. Walked through a couple of, couple of plays, and um, like I said, we're gonna be um, ready tomorrow. Kyle Goon. Hey Dennis, you guys had a little bit of a groove right out of the All Star break, right before LeBron got injured. What did you like about um, your guys' style of play? What what worked for you during that winning streak? Um, I mean. Playing fast, getting stops. You know, it was number one uh, on the defensive end. Try to get steals, and try to play fast. You know, Phoenix um, did a better job or a great job last game for you know holding us up and not able to play so many you know fast break and get fast break points. So, I mean, we did you know uh, work on that as well, and um, I mean we. Just, uh, we, we didn't play great, you know, in game four. Uh, I mean, myself, I didn't play great. And um, I mean, we, we, we know what we have to do, you know, to um, get game five and uh, just go out there and give everything we have, you know. Um, it's 2-2 two -two right now, it's a good series. And uh, yeah, we just want to go out there and uh, compete and win a, win a game. Bill? I didn't actually have a question, thank you. Oh, well, thank you. Uh, Mark Medina, please. Hi, Dennis. Um, how did you see AD handle this season with both, you know, being out for such an extended period of time with his injury, and then this week with trying to play through some of his other injuries? I mean, he wants to play, uh, like everybody in this locker room. I mean, um, he, he he got a passion for, for this game. He want to play. He want to help us, you know, uh, get a win. And um, I mean, I seen uh, I played with a couple of, you know, superstars. And um, I mean, he he really want to be out there. He given everything he have his last percent and um, just try to make it work, you know, for us. And uh, it means a lot for me, the organization, teammates. Uh, means uh, means a lot, you know. So, um, yeah, it's, it's it's just uh, great to see. We'll take two more questions, Alan Sliwa. Hey Dennis, just uh, curious to get your thoughts. When you you had two games, game two and games two and three, where you scored over twenty points, um, is there something about those two games that you found yourself, um, I guess, from an offensive perspective, was there? Anything that you could point out that you saw in your game or what Phoenix was doing that you were able to have that much uh, that much offensive uh, contributions? I think uh, with AD and Bron, you know, uh, when both of them playing, um, you know, they try to take away with them too, and uh, I got to be aggressive then, you know, um, off the you know ball screens and stuff, uh, try to touch the paint, and then if I'm open, just shoot it with confidence. And if they're committing, then just find uh, my find my open teammates. And um, I mean, when one of them not playing, you know, then I try to facilitate, you know, try to find for open, uh, search for the open threes, you know, for my teammates so they get in with them. And we, you know, like we had in in, in Brooklyn, for example, you know, uh, where both of them didn't play and. Um, sometimes it changes, you know, um, and I'll be ready for whatever it is. Um, 
but uh, yeah, for sure, game two, game three, it was uh, for sure scoring, um, coming off, you know, and uh, just being aggressive. And um, I mean, tomorrow, whatever the defense gives me, you know, I try to, I try to do. Um, that's that's pretty much it. Last question, Jordan Richard. Hey, Dennis, just uh, piggybacking off a little bit of what Alan just said. Um, you know, looking at the game yesterday, when you were driving, they were bringing Aiden a lot in the help, and they were also bringing McCall Bridges. And then in the mid in the mid range, they were bringing Devin Booker for help. Did you see a lot more help in this game? You know, coming from their defense than you did the other two. No, for sure. Um... Uh, was yeah they they clock in the paint you know uh, where we playing pick and roll um, they try to swarm the paint and uh, we got to beat them with you know threes um, by the end of the day you know we I still got to be more aggressive touching the paint getting there and you know then make the right decision um, if, even if it's not scoring if I score two points but you know I have uh, um, great, you know, hockey assists or assists, then um, it's great, you know, that we get the W. So for me, it's, it's not about scoring 20 or 30 um, and then lose the game, you know, potentially lose the game. I mean, I want to make the right decision um, for the team to get better. So um, it, don't, it, don't, it don't matter what I have to do, but I got to be more aggressive getting into that paint and then make a good decision, you know.